Hello Divination, welcome to this tutorial where I will be showing you how to change the colors of the illustrations that are included within the Copywriter Layout Pack. So first of all, I'm going to show you how to do that within the Divi Builder and next I'm going to show you how to do it in Illustrator. So without any further ado, let's get to it. So first of all, we're going to show you how to make modifications to the colors of your illustrations with the Divi Builder. So for that, we're going to move on to the landing page, which contains a lot of illustrations, which you can see over here. And the first thing we're going to do is enable the visual builder, which will allow us to see changes happen in real time. All right. So then we're going to scroll down until we come across the first illustration, open the image module, move on to the design tab, open the filter subcategory and start playing around with the hue. As you can see, um, the colors will be changed once you play around with this hue option over here. And once you decide on a color, you can just copy that color and move on to the next illustration. Again, go to the design tab and add the same hue to that image module. And we're going to do the same thing for this last illustration over here. And then we're just going to save our image modules and our page and exit the visual builder. So the next possibility you have is changing the illustrations by using Illustrator. And for that, you have to go to the following blog post, scroll down until you come at the end of this blog post. And then you'll see that you can download all of these images over here for all kinds of purposes. So go ahead and click on that button over there. But I have already done that and I have my folder over here. So as you can see, it's a zipped folder. So the first thing you will need to do is unzip that folder. And once you do that, you'll have to go looking for the Illustrator file by going to Illustrations, Source. And over here, you can see that the Illustrator file is included. So go ahead and open that file. So of course, you will need Illustrator on your computer in order for you to be able to edit all of the illustrations. So then just wait until the Illustrator file opens. And as you can see over here, all of the illustrations are included within this file. And the first thing you will need to do is enable swatches within the window option over there. And once you do that, you have to go looking for the global accent color, which is the following one. Over here, and you just double click on it and then you get this following screen and over here you can modify the colors and you can also preview them if you want to see all of the changes happen in real time. So then just go ahead and play around with the colors until you come across one that you like and there are other color modes as well if you want to choose another option. So just play around with these until you're satisfied with one. All right, so I'm just going to go with this color, which is applied to all of my illustrations, as you can see on the screen. And the next thing I will need to do is export all of these illustrations. And the easiest way to do that is just go to export, export for screens. And over here, you can see that you can export all of the illustrations at once. And of course, choose the folder and make sure that the images are PNG. And then just simply click on export artboard. All right, so once you open the new folder, you'll see that you get all of the illustrations with the modified color. Now the only thing that's left to do is change the illustrations on our website. So I'm just going to open this image module over here and simply just upload my new illustration. All right, and 
Then I'm also going to make sure that my hue option is set to zero degrees. Well, that was all for this tutorial. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up and make sure that you subscribe to our social media channels so you'll get a notification every time we have something new for you. Thanks again for watching and we look forward to seeing you in our next video.